So the plan was to have a baby in July and get back playing for the start of the season three months later. Easy, right? There's always been that sort of elephant in the room in that if you want a family, that's kind of your retirement. I don't think there have been many women's rugby players who have had children with the intention of coming back. I'm pregnant, but I still want to work hard and I still want to be pushed. As a coach and husband, it's a very interesting role. I'll put it like that. Ultimately, he will decide if she's wearing a shirt on that day or not. Which is going to be the best decision for the squad, not just the best decision for Abby. She's trying to get back and find her identity again as a rugby player as well as a mum. Rugby, although it's been pretty high on the priority list for a long, long time, I think it becomes a distant second pretty quickly. I want to be a world-class player, I want to be a world-class mum. The challenge is, can you be both? <laughs>